learning is like breathing. I think if we look back at the history of human beings and even some of our predecessors, uh, we learn, right? Because it, it, is, it is the way our minds work. We, or most of us, I mean, there probably are some exceptions. I won't mention any in my house, but, um, <laughs> but um, usually when we see something, we're thinking about, how can I do this better or faster or where else can I use this skill or this knowledge? And all of that is learning and it seems to be what humans do. And that's why I'm talking to you on Skype over a, a laptop, right? And not a, not a telephone or not two tin cans connected by a string, right? So all these are examples of learning. And it's just that we look at something and think about how can we do this better or faster or cheaper or automate it in some way. Um, so learning is like breathing. Why do I think lifelong learning is important? Well, if we stop breathing, we die. So if you stop learning, if you stop learning new things, it's, it's kind of a mental death. So some people choose that, by the way, but I don't think it's a natural choice for, for people. I, I installed a screen door at my townhouse yesterday and learned something about carpentry. I mean, I, I learn things all the time, medical things. I spent uh, a week in Israel, for example, learned a lot about, uh, just got back from that trip. Um, so I, I, I can't even begin to give you a list of, uh, so it's mostly what did I learn yesterday or but um, yesterday was carpentry.